Hi everyone, today I'm doing my house tour because it was highly requested. Um, I hope you enjoy. Some things still need doing but I'll kind of talk to you about uh, what needs finishing off when I show you the rooms. Um, so I'm going to get started because Ellie's quite cranky. Um, so obviously I've got the front door there and then what I love about this hallway is it's got this... Um, kind of like full length mirror and we're actually going to get a hall table right there and um, so that's where the hall table will go and then obviously we've got the stairs there so um, just for now I've put Ellie's mini Cooper there because we've got no space I don't really want it in the living room so we just leave it there for now um, but yeah it's quite a lot of room in the uh, hall and there's little Ellie it's really hot today <laughs> So I'm like sweating, there's me, I'm like really really hot um, and we've got people coming soon so I need to bath her and put her clothes on. Um, yeah so this is the hallway, what it looks like and then as soon as you come in the front door, um, this is what it looks like, obviously it leads on to the living room so I'll show you that now. Are you going to stay there? Yeah. Yes. Um, okay, so we have um, the larger sofa there and then the smaller sofa there. We got this rug from Darnelm and it's so soft. It's the teddy bear range. I love it. Um, and then I really love these floors. I just mopped them. Um, yeah, so that's what that looks like. And then we have this huge bay window which we need to get new blinds for. So these are not going to stay here. These were already here. Um, but yeah, there's just like a huge bay window. I've just got a few frames on there. Um, and then we have a picture on the wall. And then we've got surround speakers in each corner as well. Um, and then we've just got a little table and our, f what's that called, floor lamp. The fireplace. That's what that looks like. Um, and then like the TV area there. And then we've just got the light up there. And then this is Ellie's toy corner for downstairs. Um, my dad actually bought this um, kitchen for her yesterday and I absolutely love it. It's not too big as well, it's like the perfect size. So um, I just put that in the living room. And she doesn't really play with it yet, um, but I know like next year she will play with it. I might put it in the garage for now. Um, but this is like her little play area, as you can see she's already got to it. Um, but we've just got her, this is one of her favourite toys at the moment. She absolutely loves it. And then there's a few like toys and stuff in there. Um, and then obviously there's the hallway. And we've got the picture up there. So this is the lounge. I'll quickly show you again. What are you doing? Ellie loves this house because there's so much room for her. So yeah, this is what the lounge looks like. Yeah, silly. Okay, and then going down the hallway, are you going to hold my hand? Yeah? <coughs> Coming in. Uh, we have a radiator um, and then another door and then we have some kind of storage under here which I really like because I kind of store um, all my pram, well not all my prams, one of them's in the car um, but this is obviously our silver cross surf so we just keep this under the stairs and her car seat and hoover so I just put all that there and then in this cupboard is just like tools and pools, bits and bobs um, so that's really handy that little space, I'll show you what it looks like from down here So yeah, that's that. And then, when we walk through here, this leads us onto the kitchen, which is my favourite room. I absolutely love this. And you'll see Ellie. Hello. <laughs> um, yeah, so, when you first walk in, you have the dining table. This was my mum's old dining table, and we thought it was perfect for this house. I've just got a... Um, 
table cover on if anyone's interested this is from Darnelm also um, but I really really love it and then we have Ellie's high chair and that's where I charge my phone and then I got this steam mop the other day which I absolutely love I'm going to do a review on it um, it's amazing so yeah I just put my steam mop there and her high chair and that's what the kind of dining area looks like and then she's got a few photos, they were already there, um, but the middle one was ours. So I need to change them photos. And then we have a lovely little kind of window looking out onto the garden. And then at the window area I just have a few um, new home cards, my orchids and our placemats and coasters. And it's such a beautiful day out today. Um, I think we're going to get new blinds as well. These were already here, these um, kind of like nets. Um, so moving on, we have our calendar and another little canvas. Okay, I had to pick Ellie up because she's just being destructive. Um, we've got the boiler there and then um, I just keep the monitor for when Ellie goes down for a nap. I keep it in the kitchen because that's usually where I am. Um, and then I love the worktops, these kind of wooden oak worktops. They're my absolute favourite. Um, we've just got cupboards, the washing machine, and then we have the sink, um, another window here, and then some more cupboards, and the end one here is a dishwasher, which, oh my god, I love dishwashers now. <laughs> um, and then we have the back door, and um, this is Tilly's little area there. Um, and then another window up there, and then we have the hob and microwave area. And I hate the red tiles, but obviously we can't do much about, about it. I have looked on getting stick-on tiles, but it's just going to cost too much, so we're just going to bear with it. Um, but yeah, it's all touch screen, the hob. And there's the oven. And then moving on, we have cupboards up here as well, which is really, really handy, got our kettle, tea area, and then that's all like Ellie's bits, her bottle machine and all that, and then we have these drawers which, yeah. so yeah I love these drawers because they're so deep, and this one is Ellie's drawer, as you can see I need to sort it out a bit, are uh, so big, you can get so much in them. Um, and then we have the fridge freezer. And then my favourite part of the kitchen are these shelves. Give you a sneak peek of the fridge. Very bare. Yeah, there's quite a lot of room in this fridge, which is handy. And then um, I just keep all my mugs in this cabinet here. So I thought I'd quickly show you the garden. Um, I'm actually at the window because it's... I think the grass is wet out there, but um, yeah, this is a garden, and we have like a storage shed garage thing there. Um, yeah, it's quite a nice size for us. Okay, so as you come up the stairs, um, the bathroom is the first room, and I really love the bathroom. I love the tiles, um, and all the like different shades of blue. So we've got the sink area here which is really good because it's got storage and I just store all Ellie's um, bath stuff and her toys and then we have the toilet um, window area and then we have our bathroom kind of tower storage thing there as well behind the door um, and then we have the bath. With the shower. So yeah, I love this bathroom. That's what that looks like. 
And then the next room we have is Ellie's. And the first thing obviously is her door. Okay, so as you walk in, this is what the room looks like. Um, we've basically finished in here. The only thing I have to do is get some blinds and curtains and this room is done. This thing is this canvas on the wall. Okay, so on this wall we have a bookshelf here. This is from Ikea and it was only £12, so um, I thought that was a bit of a bargain. Um, so I'll quickly show you what I've got on this bookshelf. So we've got a frame that was personalised for her when she was born, this little rocking horse, a frame and a snow globe, and then that little sheep's usually on there as well. And then on the next shelf we've got a nursery rhyme book, it's really really cute, got that from Ireland, um, her scan photo, her money box, some little converse socks and little, it's like a little Barbie doll thing um, that I used to have so I thought I'd hand that down to her and then on this shelf we have um, this little crystal bear from Ireland this teddy bear which is so cute and this photo frame that I actually need to put a photo of her in I just recently got that and then on the bottom shelf we've got her record book, a little hairbrush, and then we've got a few baby kind of slippers and booties there. Next to the bookshelf we have this, I call it the tower, and basically this just filled with nappies and wipes, pseudo cream, all kind of changing stuff. Um, so you've probably seen it in some of my videos, but yeah, there's just like cotton wool, all stuff like that in there. I'm not gonna go too much into detail. Um, but that's her tower and then on top of the tower we have her monitor set up so it's kind of looking into her cot. Um, this penguin is a night light which is really really cute and then we have this butterfly lamp from Wilkinson's. Okay so on the floor we've got this pink rug. This was from Darnelm and it was the teddy bear range or the teddy bear rug and it is so so soft and it goes really really well with a room. In the corner of a cot we just have her teddies and soft toys for now and so yeah they're just kind of piled there and then next to that we obviously we've got her cot and um, if anyone's wondering this is from Babies R Us and it actually turns into a toddler bed as well and um, she had this in the old house and it has a drawer underneath which I still need to fill uh, but yeah she just got her mobile there mobile uh, her dressing gown and blanket and then in the cot she has um, a teddy another look and this floral fitted sheet is from Nex. Above her cot we just have her Ellie canvas until I find out what else to put there um, but I got that done by someone on Facebook. Next to the cot we have the radiator and just like a little toy area. Most of her toys are downstairs so this is just this is just a small collection of her toys. We've just got her walker. Um, these boxes are from Argos, these kind of storage boxes. Um, this one's got all her books in it. Um, we've just got a pepper pig balloon there, which she likes playing with. Her balls, and then there's more toys in that box there. So most of them are downstairs, which will... This is her window area. Like I said, we still need to get blinds and curtains but for now she's just got some nets up with these this bunting which is from I think it's from the factory store and then her dream sign which I might put above the cot. Next to the window we just have this um, light up heart from Home Bargain. Next we have her wardrobes these are from Ikea and if I can find the link I'll put it in the description box. But at the side we just have some more nappies and her changing mat. And then I will show you what's inside. So in this bit of the wardrobe is all shelving which is really, really, really handy. And I will show you what I put in there. Okay, at the top we just have her bibs at the back and these are all hair bows. In here are all her tops, so these are all long sleeved. 
and um, these are like pretty vests at the back is all short sleeve t-shirts there's quite a lot of them in here are all her leggings and then kind of like her jeans and tracksuit bottoms so they're all her bottoms and then here is all um, stuff for when she's a bit bigger and um, some cardigans and there's just like a romper there so this is inside the main bit of the wardrobe we just got her dresses and coats hung up there. we have this kind of storage tower which is really really handy um, and in the top drawer we just keep her sleep suits uh, these are all her vests and pyjamas which I need to sort out <laughs> Um, these are all socks and tights and then in the bottom is all hats and summer hats and then we have all of her shoes so all of her shoes and we've got a few more on top of this so that is her wardrobe inside and then there's also a shelf at the bottom where I just put her raincoats and like thicker dressing gowns and stuff like that lastly next to the wardrobe we just have this um coat hook thing that me and paul made when i was pregnant and um, we just got a few things hanging here that are really pretty and i wanted to display uh, we have her newborn dress there a tutu and this sleeping bag it's like a shabby chic sleeping bag I don't know if you can see there um, and then we just have this sign that we got when she was a newborn so that's everything and then we have the door And then um, to this room, this room is probably the least finish and the other bedroom. This is our bedroom and we still need to paint this wall. I don't know if you can see that but we need to paint that wall. Um, and also I'll show you some before and after pictures because the living room is actually bright green and we painted it. This wall was purple and Ellie's bedroom was red so I'll kind of insert some before pictures. Uh, but we've ordered our bed, that's coming next week, which I'm so excited about. We need to get new curtains, same with Ellie's room. And then we just have like chest of drawers, wardrobe, uh, my dressing table. This this needs a lot of work, this room, but um, yeah, we're kind of leaving this to last because we wanted to get Ellie's bedroom sorted first. Um, but yeah, it's quite a good sized room. So yeah, that's our bedroom. And then the last bedroom, Ellie, you can hear Ellie downstairs, is, um, oh, this will be an office. Uh, we need to paint that as well. The landlord done like really bright colours. Um, but at the moment we're just kind of using it as like a laundry room as you can see. Um, and Ellie's presents and then stuff I have to sort out which is there. Uh, but yeah, this will be an office. I really like this area here because it's got shelving which is great storage and this kind of cupboard here um so yeah this was originally a nursery i think um but we're going to use this this will be too small for ellie's bedroom so this will be an office so yeah that is my quick house tour really sorry for the way i look but um i've just been cleaning all day um so yeah i hope you enjoyed our house tour and so it's a bit rushed but ellie is due for a nap Aren't you? Aren't you? Yes. Yeah. So yeah, I hope to see you soon. Say goodbye. Say thanks for watching. Yeah. Bye bye.